Sagittarius, welcome. We are here for you. Thank you for your patience with this, uh, this channeled dispatch. I feel like, wow, something really incredible is coming here for you, Sagittarius. It's a surprise. It's, um, it's an epiphany even, okay? Some of you here, you're going to have a huge awakening in January. It's going to be huge. Um, I mean, there's really... We'll say it in a simple way because it's, I mean, it, we can't, we cannot, we cannot, I mean, we cannot know. I mean, we cannot know. Okay. So maybe there is a bit of a surprise, an element of surprise. So we'll keep it, uh, so we'll keep it a surprise. <laughs> but yeah, let's see what spirit does want to say about it. We have the five of wands. Wow. If you are doing, um, sort of like an audition here or you are like competing here for something, I see that, um, you know, your, your greatness, you don't know yet. You don't realize yet the capacity of your creativity as well. I'm hearing that, Sagittarius, many of you here. You're going to have experiences come around for you. Wow, that's amazing. Um, the, your cards are just, like, spectacular, honestly. Um, the Ten of Cups, we got the Six of Cups. <laughs> Justice, the Magician. Um, you are going to rock this, okay? I'm hearing that song. We will, we will rock you. Ch -ch yeah, you are... Mm -hmm. You're gonna be some of you are gonna become a rock star. I don't know if you know you had it in you, but yeah, you're gonna you're gonna have something here that you create as well. And I feel like um, you know, you're going to for some of you, it's this month that you'll become well renowned. There's something that's gonna go all around. I'm hearing all the, around the world. Yeah, maybe um it's like you're touring the galactic even. Some of you here, there's something you're gonna manifest and it's really going to disseminate far beyond your wildest dreams. I'm hearing a lot of music. I'm hearing that song Wildest Dreams, yeah, Taylor Swift. Isn't she a Sagittarius? Interesting. Justice, the Ten of Cups. Now, what I am getting here for you, Sagittarius is that I'm hearing uh, Gemini and Cancer. There's something here. Yeah, I see you going all the way to the top with something. Um, it could be a record. It could be something you hit. You hit a height with something here. Um, you would have never imagined, though. As high as you maybe thought, well, I'm going to win this. Okay, but you didn't know at what degree, what threshold, really, we're talking about. And I think that's your guide speaking. Okay, that's your that's you that's your higher self speaking. Uh, psh, little towel on the shoulder, Gemini. No, it's no worries. Not your devil's advocate. It's uh, the door, and there's someone standing behind it that I don't think you expected. Okay, I hear. It like that there's some kind of major surprise here for you so i feel like that's part of your level up is you know that moment when we just don't see it coming as well okay we're just out of breath at the end of the race we don't even know who's standing at the end okay to hand us oh we got a trophy on top of all that yeah sagittarius there's something here waiting for you at the end of that really big rainbow let's get here a little further this is definitely a surprise, okay? So some of you here, oh, no, I know what it is. You don't know. You don't know. I'm going to tell you, yep, some of the source. Spirit's a really good, really good storyteller. Okay, you are the ruler of the ninth house, but spirit, spirit's on another level when it comes to, yeah, each of the zodiacs, honestly. So it just, it's, yeah, it's going to, you're going to love it, but it's not at all what you can imagine. There we go. Third week. Second day in. I'm here in surprise. Like there's, oh yeah. So this is something that you have been divinely ordained to receive. This is something that you have been by divine order. You've been cast and you've been dealt this hand. People on the other side have decided that it is you who they want to represent as well. This glory. It is a crown. You will be crowned. I heard like that. You will be given a crown. Okay. To, yes, to empower others as well in the same way that you have learned your way around this, uh, we'll say matrix, okay? There's something here that you've, that you've earned. Um, and I keep hearing, you don't know. Like some of you, I think you, you, you want to know. You want I want to know though. I, you know, but you can't, I hear like that you just can't imagine. I keep hearing that. Yeah. There's definitely some, um, really big awakening. Okay. I just keep seeing it like that on the two of cups. Wow, I'm hearing, I knew you. I knew you before I met you. I, yeah. I knew I loved you before I met you. Returning the sacred on the rest of the body. Yeah, definitely. This is no spirit keeps saying, 
even every clue they give, they pull they pull the sense of it back. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Wait, what? Who's that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's because they want you to truly enjoy it for what it is in the moment. Like, you have to experience this sense of celestial sort of um, Cupid's play. You have to um, agree in some way, though, to it. You know, Spirit is saying this is the only way that we can, we can manifest this is for you to not have any idea of what exactly it is. And that's on the higher plane, I feel. It's not something you would even have thought of, you know. And this is part of it. You've been um, climbing a mountain, you know, with, with humble tears drawn at either side of your face. Like, you have not really known how far you've really gone. And it's because you are genuinely in love with what you do. And, um, you know, spirit here is by your side. And they want you to know that they also have been riding with reason, you know, the, these things, you know, that you, that you feel every now and then, right? These shoulders on your, on, on your hands. I hear it like that. You know, there are people around you on the higher plane, such a terrorist who, um, you know, they take those paths with you wherever you go, you're guided and, and there's a reason for it. It's not like, well, you know, return and throw chakra. It's not like, you know, random that we have this sort of protection as light workers here. You have a very particular guide as well. And there's something very, very particular that this person wants to give you. And it's something here. I'm seeing flashes of light that you have known was part of this way about your craft as you proceed into the next ways that you carry it out. I'm um, your right for the rest of your life. Wow, there's something here. It's almost like a blessing that your guides want to sort of bring, um, bring, bring. Okay, bring, bring. Yeah, you're gonna get a phone call. Spirit, I'm hearing spirit. Some of you hear spirit. Well, yeah, yeah. This is um, this is due. This is due. I feel it has to do with your major life path calling and and it's like this is the initiatory step some of you here it could be in any kind of form but it is going to be a threshold marker for how it is that you carry out another aspect of your life and it is about you empowering others i keep seeing flashes of light here some of you it's fame you're going to be a household name you're going to be a household face your face will be known um you're gonna be an icon okay that's for some here some of you it's in the music industry some of you here i see um and I'm a channel of Star Seed Oracle Medium. Or light, this is a light work on behalf of the Pleading Light Body Council, right? These are downloads. This is not going to be for everyone watching. Um, this planet, right? We have a lot of different sort of beings here. I'm talking to light workers. I'm talking to those who are doing shadow work. I'm talking to high spectrum beholders of Jupiter. That's really what we're looking at in this reading of Sagittarius. When we're saying Sag, I'm, I'm saying the ninth house. We all have a ninth house. And the magic is... Is there at your disposal of each element and archetype should you be in the higher form of sort of receiving it by doing shadow work um, by way of sort of initiating um, you know through the journey of understanding really what you want to manifest through that um, house in particular and that is by way of knowing your shadow in that house so anyways but to go back to it this is really a very special moment and I'm hearing it's a generous hand that spirit deals you you're gonna feel it you're gonna know it you're just gonna look up to the sky and say wow Spirit was really listening. Spirit was watching me. Spirit understood my my moments, okay, as something that I didn't even know, okay. They, they, you know, could 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 really become more than it was in that moment to me. Like you thought your challenges were maybe um, just just challenges, but really they were connective dots for you and spirit to understand more deeply why it is that this connection matters the one that they bring your way it could be to a place it could be something particular a new position in your work something is going to make you feel the magic yet again i'm hearing that as well it could be that you come full circle with something and you just feel like you know you take your life to the next level in some sense and and um, I, I'm here when you're ready for it. But yeah, like I feel, yeah, I definitely see some of you going to be like a big time performer. Like I see you have like an earpiece, like this is a big thing uh, for you, I feel as well. Like, I mean, you could see it as it's not like, oh, well, that's not a big deal. It's a big deal. It's not like it's, oh, you know, it's just between me and spirit. It's a feeling of what you carry out to the world. Um, I'm seeing cauliflower. So like, I'm, I don't know if it's cauliflower. It's uh, like purple. Okay. Anyways. I think it's a purple broccoli. Uh, I don't know. My fruits and vegetables, apparently. Okay, but yeah. 
Um, but you, Sagittarius, are gonna, like, this is a, a, a spirit wants to say to you that you are ready for this next chapter. And what they bring to you is a sort of handshake that then I'm hearing you take a medallion from, you take, you take something from that moment that you experience. This moment with spirit takes you momentarily back to those moments that were really hard and keep seeing flashes of light and those those moments it's like you have this meaning become of your story more so i keep seeing this flash of light that's crazy some of you are going to be paparazzi famous like this is uh, when we say bright flash of light i'm talking really bright like someone is literally taking like a like a serious like picture over there okay it's very bright some of you here um you know you are going to be given the keys and this is going to be how it is that you merge your vision and your passions with this third dimensional paradigm in reality you're going to see it it's going to click in january at some point i'm hearing the 17th i see another flash of light there the 17th and the 18th some of you you may literally win like the lottery this is for someone i'm not saying that that should be everyone's dream right but i'm hearing it something like that i mean and honestly this is so serendipitous i mean this is not even serendipitous this is your methodical approach towards elevation that is uh you know going to be met okay with with equal measure in the 3d for you like the things you've been working at on the astral are now gonna come to surface and they're, well, they're going to be known. Uh, some of you here, you know, I'm almost seeing like you, you cry, I'm hearing you cried as you climb this mountain. I'm hearing silently, you know, and, and, and it's like at the end of the conversation, like lo and behold, someone was recording you the whole time. I hear like that. And, and, and then, you know, and they, and they want, they have the account. You thought you were going to sort of, um, have a moment to sort of uh, appreciate this journey and maybe solitude again but no spirit has your story here okay for the world to be now known and some of you here this is an opportunity of a lifetime for you possibly to literally be um more well known than you could have ever imagined i you know you're gonna take it as you will I, we could that could be meant in many ways i'm seeing that for you though this is that ticket and it's like the moment that you um i'm hearing something about crayol you don't i think it's a type of of dish like cooking like creole 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 cooking cajun cooking okay yeah th maybe this is it yeah so going back to even in a mm -hmm, this is something that you are accessing but it's also something of an appreciation and so it's like many things that Jadera is like kind of rolled into one for you and i feel like you're going to feel that this is a spirit's way of just giving you one really fucking big hug okay you're gonna be like wow i literally have that i have that and i have that you're gonna be having more than you asked for such a dare is and you're gonna have a lot of time on your hands as well to pick those pieces apart and really understand just how amazing spirit is and just how amazing you are sagittarius your guys want to say we appreciate your work here on this plane more than you will know and they're they're trying the best in this way that they can to make this known to you and because you are in human arc incarnate form you know you have limitations and so they know that you know they're they but they still want you know your spirit guides they want to say it as as best they can to your human consciousness that you are so extremely valid i hear it as well in that way like some of you maybe you feel that you know you are you are sort of a mystery or an enigma um but spirit is saying you you don't see it yet but you know i'm almost getting like someone trying to tell someone who's going to be famous in the future like you, right now you're famous like to us like in the world we're living in you are already famous uh this is for someone okay i'm yeah this is about reminding you as well okay that you have what it takes to be everything that you will become in this very moment here right now it's so powerful for you Sagittarius like this is really about you imagining and I feel like you've done that and now spirit is responding and so you're going back and forth in a way that I think you never have and, it, and it's going to be felt you're gonna have a day here um sort of come about I'm hearing something about the 18th again there's something that is in the air um you will know it you will see it you will you will know that it's for you okay and um 
and, it, and it's something that seems, okay, very real. It could even be something uh, so strange, because, like, right there, Jade is under the table. He is a Sagittarius, right? He was breathing on my knee, um, and I could just feel the heat of his breath on my knee, and it was only right then and there, and I looked down, he's looking up at me with a big smile. So there's something here that you will sort of um, embrace even, Sagittarius, okay? Like, this is really return it to sender. Let's clear the energy. I'm hearing something about um, a past life energy. There's someone here who realizes that you have uh, elevated and they are realizing that they have not elevated and so you have what it takes to also accept that fact and because you are you are here not because okay you are here and you've been here before so there are things here that you lead forward with and people will feel like they're following you and they may not like that feeling and that is part of why they're following you okay let's say it like that that's for a few of your so-called followers Sagittarius you need to know that you inspiring people some people take the higher road some people try to fight the path either way Everybody takes the journey, okay, home. And so, you know, you are a leader. You are you are a prodigy, Sagittarius. You are going to be very well known in this space. And Spirit, yet again, is saying, we see you here already. You know, they say when the, when the artist passes, that's when they become the most famous. And someone's trying to tell, for instance, Einstein, before he would have blown up, hey, you know, I see you. It's like someone literally, you know, speaking to Picasso, okay, when he was painting, hey, like, I literally can see your grandeur in the next few seconds centuries you know and, uh, and they want to sort of hold your hand in that moment and just get your autograph Sagittarius thank you so much for tuning in I love you guys and I really wish you the best in this first month of 2024 bye